Okay. Uh, good morning. Well, I was gonna, sh I was gonna try streaming again, but uh, I just, I was just too tired. I ended up uh, taking like, like two or three naps throughout the night, which is having difficulty staying up. Uh, so basically, I'm now forcing myself to do this. So, <clears throat> so I just feeling like crap for some reason I don't know why but um, what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna go ahead and uh, yeah I'm gonna gonna create a duel list um, he's gonna be solo self-bound hardcore just like all the rest of my guys and I'll just go ahead and save that hopefully I can remember to put the sound back on the reason I'm doing this is because during because during this period here I'm guessing this guy here, he'll, he'll start saying, You are hereby sentenced to die on the Isle of Rayclass, or whatever it's called, and it really messes with my speaking. So, that's why. Um, but, this is going to be subject to change, but right now what I have in mind for him is uh, dual wielding, and his focus is going to be bleed damage. I don't possibly maybe hopefully poison damage I think um sometime last night I took a gander at the uh, skill tree and I think there was uh, some nodes that um that gave you both poison and bleed but I don't know if uh, if it'd be feasible to do like if it'd be feasible to do with uh doing both at the same time as far as I know I think poison was a shadow ability not a duelist one and also, the reason I'm going with Duelist, because uh, I don't want to make the same mistake I did on my Shadow, where, um, in order to, in order, uh, Shadow's main ability was Viper Strike, which is, uh, just a single target ability, I had to put, uh, I had to get, I had to get an extremely lucky drop that, uh, it had two red sockets where I could put Ancestral, Ancestral's Call and Melee Splash in there just to give it some AoE, just to make it, just to make it viable to me anyway um so I'm going with duelist now because it's, I'm going with duelist instead of ranger because uh duelist also has strength also has red sockets as part of his makeup so that's what I'm gonna need and um especially on uh, life gate on hit um life leech uh rejuve totem um there's another one you don't get it till later. I think it's Stone Golem. It gives you uh, it gives you health regen, just like uh, Marauder here. Marauder uses all of them. Okay, I think that's everything. So that's it. Let me get to creating. Oh, okay. Like always, hardcore. Solo self solo self found because it cuts out a lot of the BS. Uh, as far as uh, other players in game, I don't trust them as far as I can throw them. And considering what a weakling I am, they ain't gonna be able to throw them very far. And I'll think of a name for him. Still thinking. Still thinking of one. Um, some schmuck. Hey, and it wasn't taken. Okay, so off we go. And um, as far as um, as far as the weapon goes, I'll have to look at it in game. But it's gonna either be a sword or an axe. I don't know which. I don't know which yet.
Whoa, 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 that lagged a bit. And I guess uh, one upside to go on the bleed route, you get this immediately. Oh, something's hitting me. I had a feeling that was going to happen. I can never remember to put the sound back on after doing this. Okay, I'm gonna probably not gonna probably not gonna use my double strike. Not now. And I think uh, the big guy's coming up. not to be dead yet. Fine work with Hillock. Where'd you learn to fight like that? Oh, forget I asked. And, um... I think, uh... This here is probably going to be my main ability. Um, it probably doesn't make much sense. Uh, using an AoE ability on, like, single target. But again, I'm 
trying to avoid making the same mistake on my, um, uh, on my shadow. Uh, I'm just gonna, because in order for, uh, again, like I said earlier, in order for Viper Strike to be viable, I had to put an uh, Ancestor's Call on uh, Melee Splash in there, just so we can, just so he's hitting more than one target. Um, this time, what I'm going to go ahead and do is I'm just going to go ahead and make the AoE ability here, Cleave, my main one. Stay sharp out there. Get that out of there. Uh-oh. Rectify that problem, just move over there. Or hell, let's just do this. Like I said, I don't, I'm still debating on whether to go the sword route or the axe route, but I'm probably not, probably not going to have enough, uh, probably, gonna, probably not going to have enough passive points to, uh, to upgrade both on the tree. Is it choice that carries you? A dashing. Now there's a, Lion Eyes Watch isn't well. There's an island. I hope it's getting away. There'll be time for that soon enough. Um, now let me, uh, now that I'm in town, I'm going to show you, I went, last night, uh, I did, I did peruse the skill tree on the browser, um, I don't, I don't have a super exact plan yet, but, um, well, I'll tell you what, why don't I just go ahead and, let me get on my browser real quick. I would like to think it's taken a while because I'm also uh, recording a video game too. All right, so the route I'm going to take is probably gonna be here. Ignore all movement penalties from armor. That's a nice one to have. Because uh, if you're wielding a shield and uh, wielding any kind of body armor, I think it's those two. Um, you're already at that already puts you at minus eight movement speed. So that's a good one to have. And go down here. Oh, it's got a block chance in there. Swooping up on all those. Okay, yeah, I ain't grabbing that one. And then I'll then I'll probably go at some point. I'll just go ahead and click it now. I'm gonna have to go just far enough to get a jewel socket. After that. I'll just grab these. I can always use the resistances. And then just going down, grabbing all these. 
an additional block chance on here too. So up until now, you probably have about 10% block rate. And then I'm going over here and I'm gonna go ahead and get this. Converts all evasion rate into armor. Uh, with this, personally, my favorite, my favorite defense, my favorite other defenses, um, from best to worst, is gonna be armor, energy shield, evasion. Um, I think armor is the best defense because it's um uh, the damage you take from it is a lot less spiky. Your health just drops. Evasion is pro evasion is the worst. It's way too spiky. It's just a random chance to avoid damage. But uh, if you don't avoid the damage, so your damage is going to be, your damage intake is going to be super spiky. It's, you're going to see nothing. And then all of a sudden, you're down to almost like, you know, it can put you in a panic state. And then I'll probably go over here. And this is the part where it gets confusing. Or, I guess since I'm already over here, and I've already gotten all this, 15, 30. So, just here I already have a 30%, 30% chance to bleed, 20% chance on poison, so. And then, And I'll go ahead and grab it now. Cause life leech is very valuable. And I'll probably grab that as well. And then as far as as far as what weapon I'm gonna use. Again, it's going to be up in the air. In all likelihood, though, I'll probably go with swords because uh, axes don't have any uh, special attributes other than the fact they deal more damage and you can swing them faster. But, um... Let me back way up here. But uh, it's a long way from down there to get resolute technique. So I'll probably go with, go ahead and go with swords. Swords gives you um, swords give you an accuracy bonus. Um, let me see what that does. Ah, oh, okay. So that's how that works. One, two, three, four, five, six. One, two. So it's really not gonna it's really not gonna matter much. Okay, so So yeah, it is gonna be swords. Yes, more life leech. Grabbing up all that. And then grabbing up all that. Oh, this that's uh fire damage. Okay, then um Um, I, it will probably be a good idea if I unlock this jewel socket as well, but I don't know. It's going to have to happen at some point, so I'll just, I'll mark that as tentative. Okay. 
Okay, so... Looking up here. Um... I'm gonna leave that as is. I'm not gonna grab that. Because, um... Life regen, to me, is gonna be just as important as life leech. Because, uh... You're not gonna be spending 100% of your time killing... Fighting monsters. So... You're gonna need some, uh... I'm gonna need some health heal in there when I'm not actually attacking anything. Not to mention, I'm not exactly a sniper with the mouse either. I am oftentimes have to, <coughs> I have to slam down the shift key and start clicking something. So, let me continue. Yeah, same thing here. I might have to unlock that as well. Um, it looks like it looks like the current plan or it looks like this is this is gonna be the current plan right here like I said I can't really see anything else and it looks like it's gonna be a crit build as well I forgot to mention that so I guess there there there. Oh, guess I made the right choice going this way. Oh, yeah. Excuse me. Practically hit the jackpot over here. Thirty percent chance for poison in this area. Yeah, same thing here. Go up here, here. Uh, man, I'm not too concerned about. Oh, now I'm up in uh, Ranger territory. Let's, oh, let's see what's good over here. No, don't want knockback. I'll grab that. I just had to make my way to it. Armor. That's all. So. Let me cut that off. No, I forgot what I was looking at. There it is. Go up here. Um. When it says projectile attacks, um, I would like to think that Iron Grip would also cover uh, projectiles from, like, frost blades. Um, something like frost blades, something like, um, I'm trying to think of the name of it. It's a shadow ability. Um, shadow ability deals chaos damage. Essence strain. I would like to think uh, Iron Grip would work on stuff like that as well, but like I said, I don't know. Another 10% chance. Another 15% chance. Um, nope. 50% less mana. Uh, uh, I don't know, man. If I chose that, it's going to be a long three levels. Because I'm pretty sure by the time I get to this point, uh, 
I'm probably going to be uh, having a fair amount of abilities that reserve mana. And from what I understand of that, if you're uh, choosing blood magic, it just reserves life instead of mana, which means that's going to put me on permanently super low life, so no. And don't care about tone as much. So I guess I'll go on up here. Uh, yeah. Oh, and uh, I forgot to mention at the I forgot to mention at the start of this video, I'm not gonna be on very long. I'd probably say about 15, 20 more minutes. But anyway, this is this is my game plan right here. So let me get back to the actual game. What little help I can offer is yours. What the hell is using my CPU? Hang on, something's wrong. Thirty-five percent. Oh, I guess it's it. I guess it's this game that's using it all. Like, damn, they didn't think I was streaming or something. While we live, we are blessed. Yeah, I like new tendrils. Shrapnel shot. Uh, dual strike. Oh, excuse me. Yeah, I'll put that back. Looks like I won't be able to use anything for a while. So, red and green. Red and green makes purple, I think. Oh, wrong one. Oh, brown. Okay. I thought that. Basic R101 right there. So, this would be my uh, duelist panel. Um, 
Swoop up, uh, grab the five of them. Uh, portal scrolls. Which I have none. Nope, missed one, missed one. Um, uh, double slap. Not the most pleasant of arenas, but it'll have to do for now. One of the chance of leads. Oh, never mind. Let's try that again. Okay, so it looks like uh, I'm guessing the 25% chance stays at 25%. Swap that out. For now, I'm probably gonna just balance it out between uh, red and green. suits me.
There's a portal scroll. a portal scroll. See one upside to one upside to that having that ability that converts all your evasion into armor is for stuff like this. It gives me more equipment options because all all that evasion there is just going to roll over into into armor. So that means I'm not I'm not restricted to only armor equipment. I can actually grab up some evasion as well.
I believe in traveling light. Let's oh. just start chucking. I already have nine scrolls of wisdom, so I don't. Might have to move some microtransactions around too, because I gotta get his uh I gotta get his transmog all set up. Here we go. It's like the twelve year olds are out. Oh, what am I doing? I don't have that node yet. Little help I can offer is yours. Okay, we got gems. Frost blades. You know. Some tough mods to beat right there. Ah, uh, no. No. It's a freaking level 4 item. It shouldn't cost an orb of chance. A high level man. That's dumb. Hell, even Orb of Transmutation's a little pricey. Farewell. Oh, I still got these. But this is um uh, just one of the reasons why um uh, come on this is one of the reasons why uh, instead of just going straight down here and then through here and all that why I'm having to break off and 
get this is I didn't know I have that in my uh, stash but at some point probably like I want to say act two you get a you get a Viridian jewel I guess while I'm here that guy anytime soon. Well, this is pretty much gonna be this is pretty much what he's gonna look like just like all my other guys uh, main reason main reason I just use vanishing die um what maybe maybe when I get to the end game or let me rephrase that if and when I get to the end game and uh, my equipment won't be changing as much I won't be upgrading it as often then I might actually put some actual equipment in there but right now this this uh one size fits all setup is gonna work for me otherwise I'll be burning through these like crazy and I'm already gonna be burning through these uh just transmogging the weapons Um, since I'm at a good stopping point right now, I'll just go ahead and cut it off here. Um, I just wanted to make this video just to get him created and just kind of introduce the introduce the viewers to my new uh, character now. Um, like I said, he's I'm trying to avoid making the same mistake on this guy that I did on my shadow, where where with him. Him, you know, I had to do a whole bunch of um, bunch of shifting around and whatnot just to make him just to make him usable. I'm a melee person, not a range guy. But uh, that'll do it. Uh, I'm just gonna eat some breakfast, got a shower, shave, and all that. Got to visit the chiropractor because back's been hurting for like over a week. So, so until next time, everybody, take care. <laughs>